Okay, Haley, so tell us what happened to your foot. I got stung by a bee. Yeah, she got stung right... Where are we? Right there. And then what happened? And then they got big and swollen out of screaming outside. Yeah. Today is Friday. Haley got stung by a bee on her foot right there on Wednesday. And if you can see, can you put your other foot up next to it? This foot is all normal. And then this foot, I don't know if you can see it on camera too well, is all hugely swollen. This is all red. Yesterday it was red from here to here. And now it's like almost the whole thing is red. So her, the nurse we talked to on the phone, is all, and the cat scratched her. The nurse we talked to on the phone is real worried about it turning into a cellulitis, which I'm not even sure what that is. But because it's been two days and still swollen, we have to take her to the doctor today. And I want to make a video about this in case other people have this problem because even after talking to the nurse, I was still all freaked out about it being swollen. And um, the things they told us to do were to take Benadryl, soak it in Epsom salt, put hydrocortisone cream on it, give her Motrin for yeah. swelling. Uh, we put ice on it in the first place. Either way, like, that's all things they tell you to do for a bee sting when it gets swollen like that. But, um... No, that worked. So we're heading to the doctor today, and I'll update afterwards to tell you what they told us. So we just got back from the doctor, and he pretty much told us what the nurse had told us on the phone um, to use ice pack and Benadryl and soak her foot in the Epsom salt. He also checked her foot, felt it all that, asked if there's any fever, and checked her lymph nodes. And let me see your foot, Hale. Yeah, let me see your foot. He marked little dots with pen around her foot. And said that if the redness and the swelling persists past the line to start an antibiotic. So he gave us a prescription for Augmentin. And he said that if she gets any fevers or if the rash spreads and stuff like that, to start the prescription. So that's pretty much it. Hopefully it gets better in a couple of days.